let's go and see what five pound meal I can cook up tonight. Mark passes that trolley, let's go. First off to the freezer section and I'm going to get myself a box of these fish fingers. Next we need to get some cheese. And I think we're going to go with some mozzarella slices and they come in a square. Next we're going to get some puff pastry, some mushy peas and finally some tartar sauce. Right, so what are you actually cooking us up then, Lou? Well, we'll have to wait and see. Well, let's get to the tills and toss it up. And that's coming in at £5.44. Right, so that was a fail for a savvy meal for £5. So this £5 will have to go in the um, charity box. But let's get it home. And cook it up. And there is a charity box there. There you go. Right, so back home now, Lucy. So what exactly are you going to be making? Well, I'm going to be making some fish finger rolls. And I'm going to put some mushy peas and cheese in mine. You could put beans in if you want to, or just cheese. But first things first, I'm going to get these straight into the air fryer. You don't have to put them in the air fryer, you can put them in the grill or your oven. Just makes things simple for me. So my fish fingers are still in the air fry cooking away. So this is the fun bit. So get your cheese and it's just easier if it's already cut up. And then you're gonna place them onto the pastry sheet. So I think we'll fit about six on here. So do this as so. Yeah, we're gonna fit six on. Let's just move that one up a little bit. And like as, as I said, you can have any filling you want in here, but I think I think these work. Um, move this one along a little bit more. Right, so now I'm going to get my fish fingers out because they've near enough had the right time. Let's have a look. Check on these. Perfecto. So pop one in the middle, and obviously need six fish fingers. I won't put any more than one on, otherwise they're going to like flop open. Five and six. Now, I'm going to do some with mushy peas and some without. Do you want mushy peas, Mark? Yeah, I'll have mushy peas. Right, so I'm going to put um, three with mushy peas and three without. Two. Do you want to be nice with beans? Well, I was going to do beans because I've done like a bean bean um, pasty before, but with them being small, I didn't know whether they'd like splurt out. But you could have beans on the side and dip them in, but we're using tartar sauce, you see. Ah, nice. Right, now you get your pizza cutter, or you can use your scissors, it's up to you, but I got myself um, a pizza cutter, you know, because brand new. And we score down here and through the middle. Now all you have to do now is get the end, squidging all that and then there you go, just flatten the sides down there and then I'm just doing one to show you right now. You get your knife, we're going to score down the sides, on top there sorry, um, flick in the sides and with an egg wash or a milk wash, wash it over the top. Right, so I've got them on the baking tray now, left them on the paper that they came with, into a preheated oven, 180 for about 20, 25 minutes. And why not press the follow button for more savvy meals. And they're ready to get out. Oh, they look good. But they're massive. They look gorgeous. Let's get one onto their board. Well, they're huge. Look at them, look at them. Right, let's give them a taste, see what they like. Right, so that's the mushy pea one there, that's the one I want. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Absolutely loaded with cheese. I'm gonna dip that in the tartar sauce. Now let's give it a taste. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Great little snack, really nice. Give them a try. Um, I think you need some beans though with it. Get yourself some beans if you're gonna make them. Give them a try.